Hey, James at Barber Creek Long Range Shooting School. Today we're going to cover trying to find your twist rate because a lot of companies that make guns nowadays don't put the twist rate on the barrel. And you're going to take a nylon or a brass brush and you're going to push it all the way in until it breaks free. And you want to pull it back until it engages the rifling. Take a piece of tape and make a flag, put it right up against the barrel itself. And what I want to do is pull it back until it does one rotation. So I'm going to grab this and we're going to pull it and let it do one complete rotation. And that looks just about there. Let me grab the ruler. And I'm going to take the ruler and measure from the tape itself to the actual barrel. And I've got exactly eight inches. So I now know that this has a one and eight twist. I would go into an app like Eagle Ballistics and I would type in an eight twist and hit set. And at this point I can scroll down and see that with the velocity this gun has at uh, 2731, this is a 6.5 Creedmoor, and the station pressure that we're at, that we've got a gyroscopic stability factor of 1.722 and we're spinning this bullet at 245,000 RPMs, which means that the bullet's gonna perform well, it's not gonna be overspun, and the gyroscopic stability is gonna take us into the transonic zone for long range shooting. So a lot of folks don't understand how important it is because just because a gun manufacturer sells you a gun and it has a certain barrel twist does not mean that it has the proper gyroscopic stability for your bullet that you're shooting at the distances you wanna shoot. Understanding that the Eagle Ballistics app really helps you do that. It automatically gives you gyroscopic stability and RPMs to make an informed decision. For instance, if this was a one in nine twist or that it was shooting the wrong bullet, I'm gonna make it nine, you can see that my gyroscopic stability turns yellow. And it says, hey, you've only got a 1.3 stability factor. If it was a seven and a half twist, which some of my guns are, you can see that I've got a gyroscopic stability of 1.9, which is absolutely phenomenal. And then I've still only got 262,000 RPMs. So anyway, good thing about the Eagle Ballistics app is it allows you to get this information to make a smart decision on barrel twists, bullets, velocities that you're going to be shooting for long range. And, and it's just nice to know what your twist rate is. All right, hopefully this was a big help to you guys. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.